Hello everybody. Uh, today I am going to give a demonstration on how to uh, combine uh, contents of uh, two different cells into a single cell. Okay, so there are uh, two different matters in two different Excel cells and I want to combine uh, both those uh, say contents into a single cell. So uh, mainly this demonstration is uh, with an objective to fulfill the request as given by Savitri Bhai Phule Pune University exam coordination section uh, which uh, requests all the chairmen and paper setters to submit their MCQ question banks in a single file the multilingual uh, question bank in a single file okay so uh, a few chairmen and paper setters are um, submitting as a two separate files english and marathi and the request uh, from the university is to um, ensure that uh, in a single file it is submitted okay so a few people may have this problem of how to do that so uh, i will give you a demonstration of two simple methods it will not take much time i uh, i assure you within five minutes you will be able to do this job Okay, how many ever questions you have, whether it is 50 questions, 100 questions, 200 or 400 questions, uh, not more than 5 minutes it will take uh, okay, you to combine uh, two separate files into a single file. Okay, uh, so let us just go through the demonstration. Okay, uh, so in this file, I have uh, some, in, uh, some questions, okay, 10 sample questions I have and these are all in english okay suppose its translation is also there in another file i have the translation of these uh, say english questions say in marathi language and i want to combine these two okay so then what i have to do okay so what i will do suppose this is in a separate file okay marathi questions are in a separate file i will copy this okay and uh, uh, just below the english questions i will paste them okay so this is how what i will uh, do after doing this what i need uh, this uh, first question uh, english its uh, exact translation in marathi is over here okay so i want both these okay english and marathi translation in one cell only okay so i will use this uh, uh, concatenate formula first i'll give you a demonstration on that so what i'm supposed to do press equal sign okay and then type con so once I type CON, uh, this formula uh, concatenate will appear. Okay, and then I am supposed to press on tab key on the keyboard. So the entire formula uh, okay comes and the bracket also opens automatically. Then what I am supposed to do is I have to select the cell in which I have my source uh, text okay for the combination. So this is my first cell okay this is my first question i have selected comma and i will select its translation in an other cell and i will close the bracket enter my work is complete so easy it is okay so uh, now you can see in this cell uh, in the right hand side bottom corner okay there is a dot and uh, when i take my cursor to that it changes into plus sign okay so i will uh, with the help of my mouse okay click on the left hand side of the mouse and i will drag it okay so i have dragged laterally so the same formula has got copied in all the cells laterally uh, and even downward i am going to do the same thing okay because i have 10 such sample questions if i have more i will uh, pull uh, that much okay so uh, only 10 cells okay i need so i have to pull till 10 Okay, so my formula has got copied and uh, it is appearing in all. Okay, uh, we will check all the text and the options whether they have correctly come or not. Okay, so let me, uh, I don't have to manually enter the formula for each and every question. Okay, I just have to drag the formula and automatically, okay, it has appeared in all the questions. So uh, I add sample 10 questions and in all the 10 sample questions, okay whatever i uh, required the combination has got copied okay so now you can just see okay now see it is very clear um, uh, i have um, 
English dummy question 1, English option 1, comma 1 and here Marathi dummy question 1, Marathi option 1, comma 1. Okay, you can see in the same manner it has got copied one after the other. Okay, so this way you will be able to uh, combine English and Marathi text into one. Okay, is my work complete now? No, it is not yet complete because um, this is the source data. Okay, this is the source cell and uh, using the formula it has got combined. Okay, but when I delete the source, uh, what I have done will also get deleted. Okay, so it will not remain. Okay, for example, uh, let me delete. Okay, this is my source data and suppose I delete it. What happens? Uh, the formula applied to these cells has also gone off. Okay, so uh, then what to do? What is the solution for this? Okay, so what I am supposed to do is I will okay select the entire uh, text okay and I will have to paste it. Now I have to take care of okay I can use control C to copy but while I am pasting I will not use control V directly okay what I will do is I will right click on the mouse and I will have to paste uh, with uh, some special paste option I have to select only values okay and that can be done through uh, you can see the second option is one two three which is for values okay and when I click on it okay the values will get um, uh, now it has got copied over here okay the same 10 questions have got copied over here okay now let's try what is happening suppose I am deleting okay suppose I am deleting the questions I have deleted what had happened in the first one it got deleted but uh, the one which we had pasted from here okay so that is remaining okay so you have to ensure that this second step also needs to be done okay so in this manner you can very easily do it it's so simple okay uh, now uh, we will also try to understand how to do the how to go ahead with the second uh, method also okay so i'll be using and symbol okay so for that let me go to another sheet i will give you a demonstration of that over in another sheet okay so here i have marathi questions i have here okay translated questions i have here uh, let me take the english questions from here okay suppose these are two different files okay and i want to put them into a single file okay i have to convert them into a single file so i will first copy down just below it okay i always want english uh, in front and thereafter followed by marathi okay so in that case my selection will be in accordance to that okay so again for this formula also i will press equal to now we are going to use the second method and then i will select the uh, say text which i want first okay so i have selected this is cell c14 okay and then I am going to press on shift and uh, number 7 on the keyboard okay which is for equal sign uh, sorry it which is for and sign okay so you have got and and then I will select the other text which I want okay and I do not have to open the bracket I do not have to close the bracket and directly enter once I enter uh, it gets combined okay text uh, in the first cell and the text in the other cell both have got combined in the same manner English first year and Marathi next okay so because uh, here I have English below it but I selected English first and then Marathi okay now I want all the 10 questions similarly so I will just drag okay I have dragged and I got all 10 questions okay I want even options to be combined in the same manner I have option A B C D four options I have there okay one two three four so they also got copied okay now i will pull them also down so options for all other questions are also done options for all other questions are done okay option three for all questions copied down okay and option four also for all the questions copied down. so uh, my work is done okay that's it so now before i submit i have to ensure all other things which have to be okay properly copied now the answers 
you have to be very careful okay if the alignment changes then all the answers will change so you have to be very careful in the same order they have to be done i have not used this formula to copy down the answers because then the same uh, say symbol will be repeated for two times so that is not required and therefore it has not been done you just cut copy and paste in the same order you have to be very careful you will have to recheck it and thereafter only go ahead uh, so that is very important okay now uh, my final work is not done because what i am supposed to do is i have to ensure that if the source is deleted okay still uh, my final paper has to be there okay so what i'm supposed to do right click and uh, in paste option select this one two three or values okay and now nothing will happen to this okay so uh, now let me delete the unrequired portion okay so all this is not required for me now i need only the final okay so th this is my final text uh, which is remaining okay now this can be submitted as it is uh, hope you all have understood how it needs to be done it's very simple in spite of that if you have any uh, problem in in doing it or any queries you can always contact me over phone or through whatsapp thank you very much